Hey everyone, it's Joel from Talking Toys, and today we are back with another toy hunt. We are starting in Target, and already I found some of the X Men '97 figures. Well, two of them. I found Executioner and Magneto, and I found still a bunch of Captain Americas. So not much has changed there. Uh, looking around, I was trying to see if there's anything really new. There's Mutt and Junkyard, and of course they have the stuff Proton Blasters. Uh, Python Patrol, Trouble Bubble, Ecto-1. Uh, still got Copperhead from Python Patrol, Viper, and a lot of the Cobra Officers. Uh, they had Gary and a couple of Thieves from the Ghostbusters, and then Bakeman from the Scare or Fright Features. Uh, Superman and Hawkman. And Animal Man is still there. Old label. Everyone's least favorite superhero. I've said this before and I'll say it again. Aquaman sucks. And I'll keep saying it just because I can. <laughs> yeah, I know there's another Aquaman there. I just bypassed it. There's a Armada, Megatron. I found a Scorponok, Predacon from Studio Series, but it just didn't look that good uh, in person, so I just passed on it. They still have Tasmania Kid and they still have uh, Megatron. Going around to the other side here, uh, they've got some more Jurassic Park. Triceratops is on sale, $22. That was kind of cool. Kong, uh, still got Rocksteady, Genghis Frog, uh, Wing Bat, Wingnut, I'm sorry, Wingnut. A lot of Genghis Frog, though. Uh, Changing Bebop and also Rocksteady. So that was kind of cool. I probably have to pick those up at some point. Mouse Jaw. Still got three of those left. And then wave four. Uh, those will never go anywhere. Got a Tuscan Chieftain, which is cool. And then, of course, we've got everybody's favorite, Lando Calrissian. Still got the holograms. Uh, got Turtle Playset down there. Some Star Wars stuff. Looking at the WWE and AEW figures. Got the luminaries for CM Punk. Got Ray Fenix, uh, Thunder Rosa, and still got Penta, and one of the House of Black guys. I forgot who it was. A lot of the stuff uh, for wrestling is going on sale for WWE. WWE. Terry Boulder still there. So, all in all, not a lot to look at. Uh, over on the collectible side, we've got the Bat Cycle. A bunch of little anime figures. And we've got Batman, 66, Michael Myers, Misfits, Ghostface, uh, Trick or Treat, Joker Statue. We've got The Wanderer. I'm still debating on him. You guys let me know. Like, is he a good figure? Do you guys like him? We've got Earl Sinclair and Baby behind him. Uh, Friday the 13th, Frankenstein. A couple of different Frankensteins. Last Ronin. Got a Raphael here. Last Ronin. Got some of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles over here. Uh, Jaws got Hooper. Still needs a bigger boat. Oh, and this one's for Bob. I want to die. I really want some baseless everything. Oh. Daddy, Bob couldn't join me this week, uh, but we're still thinking about him. So I got Hawkman, uh, Halloween. Uh, look at that. It's Goku. And who else do we have here? Casey Jones. And then, of course, we've got to pay our respects. Aquaman sucks. Yes, he does, Raj. Yes, he does. I got Sinestro back here. I was hoping it was going to be one of the chase figures, but it wasn't. Scarecrow. Uh, Mr. Freeze was in the back back there. Got Ocean Master. Looks like got Robin uh, from the cartoon series. There's Hudson. Uh, yeah, I'll come back to that later. And then, of course, we've got another Sinestro down here. I was checking to see if this one. Oh, got Wednesday Adams. Sorry. And we got Sinestro, and it's still just him in his yellow suit. We got Last Ronin. I'm not a Pops person, but I do like the Last Ronin. And then, of course, we got the Shredder three pack uh, for the clones. Got uh, Lexington over here. And let's see, we've got Hudson again, Angela, Batman, a couple of the turtle figures again. And then, like always, <laughs> stupid Aquaman. One day I'll have a t shirt that says Aquaman sucks on it. Uh, we've got uh, Bosses in the Swamps, 
And that's kind of it. There's there was a couple of new things, but nothing I really wanted to just outright buy right there. As the old saying goes, we ain't found shit. My next stop was over at Ross. So I wanted to see what they had. And so far, like, you know, just my hero academia statues, little anime things here and there. Uh, some Hot Wheels stuff. Of course, I'm not really a Hot Wheels person, so I don't really pay too much attention. Some pops. Still got Avalanche over here. Uh, I still haven't found Dark Phoenix yet. So I have to keep looking. Got some Princess Leia's still. And looks like we got sirens down there at the bottom. More Hot Wheels. Even more Hot Wheels. There's a pop basketball player. I don't know. Oh, here we go. And then I found a Battle Armor He-Man. Now, this is actually a really cool find for me, except I have them, so I didn't pick them up. But I was just really happy to see, you know, this kind of made me think there should be some cool stuff around here. Another um, Avalanche and then Andor. Andor. I came over onto the next one, and I found Hordak. So there's a couple of bus saw Hordak. I think, yeah, there's two. Uh, there's another Andor. Andor. I can't say his name. Uh, Siren. Oh, yeah, there's a third one. So there's a third um, bus saw Hordak. Again, I have them, so... You know, it's not like I was in a, in a rush to pick that one up. I got some Transformers down there. And came over here, and I found another Siren. And we found Mace Windu from the 50th uh, Lucasfilm anniversary from the Clone Wars. They had a lot of Mace Windus, but none of the other figures. So I don't know if this is just overstocked on one figure, or, you know, we might see that wave again that was at Walmart would be kind of cool. And then I found a Battle Armor Skeletor. Again, have them. Didn't feel the need to pick them up, but I was excited about going to the back because I found those. I was hoping to see if we got anything here. Uh, got some Bride of Frankenstein. And then we've got, uh, down here we've got Mario and Luigi. Okay, okay. How many Mario are there between the two of you? There's three. There's, there's Mario Mario and Luigi Mario. You say so, sport. I came over here, found uh, Naruto and then uh, one of the Transformers. I know his buzz offs kind of paint or repaint, but some more of the anime figures, some more Hot Wheels, Rubik's Cubes. And then let's see, there's a Master Gundam over there. I was still trying to see if there's any new Master of the Universe, like Masterverse or anything like that. Wasn't seeing it over here. Uh, so I was kind of working my way down. Looking through the, through some of the figures here. Got more of those anime figures, more of those My Hero Academia. And uh, more My Hero Academia. Let's see. More My Hero Academia. And then there's a Fantastic Four a Fire Lord figure. This is Master Gundam. And let's see. Yeah, so there's Fire Lord over there. And then again, we're going to pay our respects over at here. Stupid Aquaman. Stupid, stupid Aquaman. And let's see if we can dig through a little bit more. There's Darwin. Uh, oh, this is Amasu, which, you know, I'm not, I'm not collecting the Dragon Ball figures. Even if I did, it'd be SH figure art figures. It wouldn't be these, these ones from Bandai. Uh, another Avalanche. No Dark Phoenix. No other figures from that wave. Another Master Gundam, a couple of Darwins, and Vulcan. Uh, dig back a little further, another My Hero Academia. And then uh, they've reduced the Barbarian Lady from Dungeons and Dragons even further. I think she's only like $2 now. Maybe 3 And then, of course, we got the twins over here. So overall, I have to say, as far as finding anything goes, we ain't found shit! Not to be deterred, I went over to GameStop for a change of pace, and I found some X-Men 97. So I found two Magneto and two Cyclops. Uh, hey, cool. Yeah, I did actually end up picking up a Cyclops. And then they had uh, Young Justice, or New Warriors Young Justice. And then, of course, we have... Aquaman sucks. 
even in the GameStop, Aquaman sucks. So kind of pushing through it. They had that three pack with Peacemaker and, and a couple of the others. Um, some anime figures, G.I. Joe. I really kind of blew past that. I really wasn't seeing anything. I really caught my eye. And then we have this uh, Dark Tide. And we had Nightwing and Jay Garrick for uh, DC figures. Uh, Chris Jericho, Lionheart, uh, Luminary, and some AEW figures. I think it's uh, Kenny Omega. That's what it was. Uh, I've kind of blown through this again just because there wasn't that much there. Came over and saw they had Kingpin and a couple of the figures from Miss Marvel or the Marvels. Uh, they had a War, Warhammer. Uh, Wolfgard, some Diablo 4, and some Warcraft figures from McFarlane, and, and of course we had the Harry Potter dragon. Not a lot. On the other side, we had Darth Vader lightsaber. We have Han Solo as the hologram, and then some Ahsoka figures. Uh, so not much there. Some of the retro figures, again, most of those were from Ahsoka. There was a, a Luke Skywalker from the Boba Fett and Han Solo. Another Han Solo there. I don't know who the Mandalorian helmet was, but uh, I just thought I'd check it out. Got a Ringy. And then I don't know who the other two anime characters are. Uh, but they seem really expensive for SH figure art figures. I mean, more than normal. Um, coming around to some Mario figures there. They have a, a the Evolution Legacy Sentinel. But I've actually checked this package out in the past. And it's been opened. So it's a pre-owned figure. And they're selling it for full price. And, of course, we got uh, Charizard and Pokemon stuff. Nothing I was really looking for. So I made my way over to Walmart, and we found, or I found, some Evolution figures. Looks like they're going on sale for uh, thirty-five fifty. And we've got Splitswing and more of the Deluxe. So of course, we got RC No Head. First figure I've knocked off the peg through this whole thing. And we've got some of the G2 Recolors. Uh, of course, we've got Strong Arm without a head back there and with a head. And we've got uh, is that bombshell. I think it's bombshell. I don't think it's scrap. Uh, yeah, it's just bombshell. Um, more of the G two figures. Of course, we get back behind some of these, and we start finding the ones without the head. One of these days, I'm going to take all the figures without heads. I'm just going to put them over in the current section of Walmart and see if they actually make a difference. I mean, they'll still be full price, of course. There's some Kong stuff. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, just kind of walking through it. Some of the uh, pizza throwers. Got Mondo Gecko, a couple of them. Got Baxter. Got Wingnut again. Uh, Genghis Frog. A couple of the movie figures. Looks like uh, Bruce Banner and Captain America are going to peg warm for a while. And then, of course, we've got the rest of the Marvel figures that peg warm from. Uh, uh... Oh, God, I forgot her name. Uh, well, look at this. Uh, we got the uh, same Triceratops. These are $33 a piece as opposed to $21 over at Walmart. Uh, got Future State. Batman over. Well, we got the Skull Ship. We got the Robins. Uh, Future State Batman. There's a lot of these that were kind of pulled down. So I like it, but I don't like it at the same time. Vampire Robin, Owl Man, Gold Labels. Uh, looks like some of them are actually $13. I didn't even pay attention to that at first. More future state, so hopefully some of these will be gone if they're actually selling them for that cheap. Luke and Grogu, we've got Hunter over here from the Bad Batch. Those are kind of the first Bad Batch figures I've seen in a while, since before Christmas. More of those five-point articulation figures. We've got Jim Gordon as Batman. More future state Batmans. Four of them there. It's like six, seven total. That, uh, we've got Boba Fett. Uh, a couple of Tuscan Raiders. Uh, a lot of Lando Calrissian, Fifth Brother. Uh, all peg warmers at this point. Some of the Ahsoka figures. Uh, Andor. Hey, I actually said it right for a change. Uh, and then we got Chopper, an Imperial officer from Andor. I still got to watch that show. And, uh, that's kind of that. Hey, look, here's a bargain. Uh, Stratos, Naked Stratos for thirteen forty-eight. It's already open for you. 
that's a bargain. You save almost five bucks. And of course, you got regular Stratos for full price there. Uh, more of the Wave 4, more Mossman, uh, Iron Grenader down there. And uh, looks like Talon Fighter and Point Dread are on sale, twenty-five fifty. I may have to go and pick up another one of those. Lady J's, Crimson Guards, nothing's changed there. Nothing's probably going to change there. Uh, Super 7 reaction figure. Uh, reached blue pass. Donatello, number two in Piccolo. And I thought this was kind of cool. Again, I don't like Pops, but there's She-Ra on Swiftwind. So that was kind of neat. Uh, got Trunks, Super Saiyan Trunks. Jump over here. And we're going to come in and see uh, Michelangelo. So that's kind of cool. And, of course, we've got... Go fuck another fish, asshole! I bet you guys thought I was actually going to put um, uh, Raj in there. Uh, we got Supergirl. We've got uh, Halloween Mike Myers. The Foot Soldiers down here, the Ultimate Foot Soldier. And we've got Splinter, one of my favorite figures. We've got Black Adam, a couple of the Reaction, Cobra Commander, Snake Eyes, Plague Spawn, I think was what that was. Brooklyn, and of course, what did we find at Walmart? We ain't found shit! All right, so these were my finds. Uh, I ended up picking up Cyclops, and I went back to Target uh, later in the day and ended up finding uh, Doc Ock, so I picked him up. Sorry he wasn't actually in the, the toy hunt for for this video, but and that's our toy hunt for the week. Uh, next week, we will be back. I hope you guys will join us. We enjoy doing these, and uh, we'll have Bob with us next time. So thanks again, and we'll see you guys next time. If you enjoyed our video, don't forget to like and subscribe to Talking Toys for more toy hunting action. And don't forget, keep on collecting and keep those figures posing. Until next time, toy amigos.